hearing it, um, not related to that, but related indirectly. Yeah. Um, a person who, and this, and I, we kind of felt this last night during the meeting. Okay, at the beginning of the meeting, it was I kind of felt like everyone was real tired. Maybe because it was Friday, it was the end of the week, people were working all week long with fatigue coming in, okay. and after about an hour or two, okay, the energy kind of picked up, you know, okay, because they had a chance to rest, yeah. okay, and and when it seems to me that when I'm at my when I'm fatigued. Okay. I'm probably more susceptible to lower level spirits um, getting involved with me. Um, and, and so there is an energetic correlation between how fatigued I am and whether it's good or not good to channel during that time. Yeah, and well there's two things going on. Firstly, I'll, I'll talk about last night and secondly, but the first thing regarding fatigue. When you're in a state of fatigue, and this applies to all of you, you are, when you're in a state of fatigue, you are actually in a state where you're more connected with your true emotional condition, believe it or not. And, and so for that reason, it's, it's very hard then to use the intellect to get you out of that condition. And that's why um, a lot of times when we're fatigued, we actually act a lot worse in terms of disharmonious with love than we would when we when we had enough sleep and, and had something to eat. But when we haven't had enough sleep and we haven't had enough to eat or we haven't had the right food to eat, generally we get all of our emotions start getting triggered in that state, the emotions that are left within us. And so and certainly that, that means then you are also more susceptible to some negative spirit influence at the same time. Last night the dynamics of what was happening was that initially with the amount of different spirits that came along with everyone to the group last night, the first hour or so, there were a lot of very questioning and and sometimes quite hostile spirits with us last night. Mm -hmm. And that depresses the energy of the group because it's the mixture of the energy of the group and the energy of the spirits that actually determines whether something is positive or not. Once, uh, once I started talking about the Jesus stuff, if I could call it that, and a lot of the spirits who were in that state left and some of the people who were in that state left at the same time. And as a result, the ones that were left over here were actually in quite a good positive condition, or they were in a condition where they were in the hills and they wanted to know more truth. And in both of those conditions, they weren't, they weren't trying to shut down or suppress truth. More accept. And so they were more accepting. So the energy difference between what was going on last night in those two sort of phases of last night, the first phase was there was this pressing energy trying to shut things down and you know how sometimes people ask questions but they're asking questions not to get the answer but rather to crit criticise and that uh, and that spirit was there with a lot of the spirits last night they all had that kind of spirit where they, they weren't prompting questions for the sake of getting answers, they were prompting questions for the sake of entrapment and, uh, and once they left then there was a much more open spirit and it's certainly the en energy of the spirits around you, just like people around you, will affect you. So if the, pe if the spirits around you are angry and you're in an angry state, you're going to get more of an angry state through that, through that interaction. Yes. If uh, you're in, a, in a quite a good state emotionally, and that, but you're going into a room where everyone else is not so good, good in terms of open and receptive, what will happen is the spirits with them will also not be open and receptive. And so therefore the feeling you have when you walk in the room is, oh, this is a bit hard, you know? And you'll, you'll become more and more sensitive to that as you progress too.